Yeah, the superintendent says that they're just trying to figure out exactly what happened. He said he got a call about noon from the principal here at Starmount Middle saying that he had several students who had headaches and were starting to feel nauseous. He says it escalated from there. Yadkin County Schools and the Yadkin County Health Department are trying to figure out why 45 sixth graders got sick at school on Monday. I got sick too. I probably threw up about 20 times. It was, it was bad. First responders from around the area came to help out school administrators and school nurses as they treated sick kids. It's really weird. Superintendent Dr. Todd Martin says there's still a lot they don't know about what happened, but he and others are committed to figuring it out. The principal called me this afternoon and said that he had several students who were not feeling well. Um, they were nauseous, complaining of headaches. Um, some had thrown up. Martin says by the end of the day, about 45 students had gotten sick. At this point, we really don't know a lot about what may have caused it. Some parents told WXII 12 that they were frustrated that messaging about the situation didn't go out to school families in a timely fashion. Martin says school staff was focused on the kids. I understand parents um, were, were nervous and upset and no messaging went out because I can tell you, you know, I saw firsthand the administrative team, the front office staff, everybody was focused on trying to help students. Martin says the health department and the district are working together to figure out what happened as kids recover from the ordeal. I still don't feel that good. Yeah, we were able to talk with that student. He said he was just still feeling a little bit off as he was on his way home from school today. The superintendent told us that initially they thought there might be some sort of CO2 leak that might have been impacting the students, but he says they were able to rule that out, so they are still trying to figure out exactly what happened. The school did post on social media earlier this afternoon saying that students who still felt sick tomorrow would receive an excused be sure to keep an eye on developments in this one in Yadkin County. Leon Denier, WXII 12 News.